following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it's for the WWE Women's Championship. From Baltimore, Maryland, Stacy Keebler. Boston, Massachusetts, where this sold-out crowd is on its feet. I'm Michael Cole, here with my ringside partner, Tag. These Boston fans are going nuts, Cole. They've gotten a taste of championship fever the past few years, and uh, they want a little more. Well, they're going to get it. SmackDown champions are here. Boston's going to see the best of the best in action tonight. No doubt what we're seeing here. These WWE fans are getting their money's worth. If they don't yet, I'm sure they will by the end of the match, Taz. I knew it was only a matter of time before we saw that. I don't like it, but as long as it wins matches, it's going to keep happening. That's the bottom line, Cole. If you're not doing everything you can to win, then you're in the wrong game. I've been looking forward to this match all night long, Cole. So have I. It's certainly been one of the most anticipated matchups in recent weeks. And, you and oh, here's the cover. I love it. Talk about rubbing your opponent's face in it. Yes, but this might not be the smartest course of action. This match is far from over. Thank you, Captain Obvious. I just think it's unfortunate whenever a superstar decides to cheat to win rather than compete fairly. Seems like things have quieted down a little bit here, Cole. I think this may just be the calm before the storm pass. You know, the key to winning a match like this is to build some momentum. And you're not going to see a match won with just one or two moves. No, but one or two big moves at a crucial point could change the direction of it completely. If you ever wondered just how much punishment a human body could take, I think you're going to get an answer tonight. You might be right, Taz. It doesn't look like these superstars are going to go easy on each other. That's not what they're getting paid for, Cole. And besides, they got too much pride to give less than 100% in there. And there's the reversal. This is not just a match anymore, Cole. 
These superstars have got a legitimate beef with each other. They do indeed. There's a lot of bad blood here for sure. And if this keeps up much longer, that bad blood's gonna wind up all over the place. This is one hell of a performance by some amazing superstars, Cole. What did you expect, Taz? This is SmackDown, after all, the number one brand in sports entertainment. What a jerk. How about a little less posing and a little more action? Pump the brakes, girl pants. There's nothing wrong with getting inside your opponent's head like this. And there's the counter, Cole. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me say this much, Cole, but I definitely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long feud. I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this match might only exasperate them. Please, Cole, watch your language, will you? It's a family show. I said exasperate. Not, oh, never mind. I'll tell you, anyone who thinks this business is a piece of cake, they should get in the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last too long against them. These are trained WWE professionals. I feel like a real jerk when somebody... Look at this, Taz! This could be it! Good night, Irene. Nobody sticks around long after taking a finisher like that. I'll tell you, Cole, this is what the WWE is all about. You're absolutely right, Taz. The greatest athletes in the world competing on the grandest stage of them all. Man, there's a lot of blood, sweat, and tears shed in that ring over the years. And if these superstars have their way, there's going to be a lot more shed here tonight. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. Hey, you know what, Cole? If you're going to get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fair, I swear to God, I'm going to throw up. Is it so wrong to ask a superstar to play by the rules, Taz? That doesn't seem to be so unreasonable to me. That's because you never competed in a match, Cole. If you did, you'd know that you got to do whatever it takes to win. And if that means bending the rules a bit, well, then that's just the way the cookie crumbles. This has been a real rocket bust of a match so far, Cole. It has indeed. But I think this crowd would like to see these superstars pick up the pace a little bit. What are you talking about? This is some classic old school wrestling here. Picking your spots and waiting for your opportunities. I think we know which way this one's gonna go, Cole. Actually, Taz, from my perspective, I think it could go either way. And what perspective would that be exactly? The perspective of somebody who has a neck that resembles a stack of dimes? You know, you can show off for the crowd all you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. Actually, Taz, I think it's a great display of confidence on the part of this great superstar. How much longer are these superstars? Well, I guess you gotta give him credit. He really suckered his opponent with that one. On the mat, shoulders down. One, this could be it. Two. Oh man, I can't believe that wasn't three. I think I've got a pretty good idea who's gonna win this match, Cole. I wouldn't be so sure, Taz, if there's one. Look at this. Finisher right there.
This ain't about winning or losing anymore, Cole. This has become real personal. Well, with the way they've been beating the hell out of each other, I'm not surprised. Man, there's not an ounce of quitting these superstars. There certainly isn't. They're in this one to the bitter end. Man, this, I'll tell you what, man. What a counter that was. I gotta say, Cole, when I first heard about this match, I wasn't sure what to think, but these superstars are blowing me away right here. Really? As soon as I heard about it, I expected a tremendous matchup, and I haven't been disappointed. Well, I wouldn't say I'm not disappointed, but I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that another time. These superstars have proven time and again that they're willing and able to go the distance. Well, you don't go too far in this business if you're not, Cole. That's for sure, partner. There's always... Superstars fall prey to that finishing maneuver. What an ink. Nice reversal. You're not going to see action like this anywhere except SmackDown, Cole. You'll get no argument from me, Taz. SmackDown is the dominant brand in all of sports entertainment. The conditions are right for a finishing move. That was a textbook reversal. Well, it looks like they're slowing the pace down a little bit here. That might not be such a good move, in my opinion. Well, come on. You just can't keep going non-stop. That's a good way to wear yourself out and make a critical mistake. No, but you can't give the opponent any time to recover, neither. You gotta stay on them and wear them down. But what about picking your spot? If you try to execute a badly timed move just because you want to stay on offense, that can have a disastrous result. I'll tell you what, Cole, let me talk about what it's like to be in a match like this, and you can cover what it's like to win. Nice quick counter. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Cole. I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in there. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up the win. Kaz, you're talking about two different things. Going outside the rules in the name of self-defense is one thing, but cheating to steal a victory and enhance your own career is something completely different. I can't remember the last time I seen a crowd so pumped up. I know what you mean, partner. These superstars have really brought the fans to life here tonight. Oh. Right there. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. You know, we've seen some pretty good back and forth action here but you don't see too many matches in that one. No, you don't. And I think we'll see one superstar dominate the match before it's over. Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult until this match is over. Look at these superstars, Cole. I mean, they're not even contemplating the fact that they might lose here tonight. They've sacrificed so much to get here, Taz. I don't think they can allow that thought to enter their heads.
When you see this level of competition, Cole, there is no doubt that SmackDown's just head and shoulders better than Raw. I couldn't agree more, Taz. Raw has some incredible superstars, no question about it. But they just can't compete with SmackDown's finest. Come on, Cole. I know you're just trying to be diplomatic, but you can't seriously sit there and say that there's anyone on the Raw roster you'd want to have here on SmackDown. No, I'm 100% serious, Taz. Can you imagine having Triple H or Batista or Chris Jericho on Friday nights? That could take SmackDown to the next level. It's crazy to think we actually get picked. Look at this, Cole. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. The match usually doesn't go much longer. These superstars have been going hard all match. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're gonna win a match if you're out of gas two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. What a reversal. It looks as if the damage may have been done here. I think we're one submission move away from the end of this match. Great reversal. is one heck of a match so far. It sure is, Taz. What do you think the highlight has been so far? Well, that'll probably come a little bit later on in the match. When you decide to shut your yap for a few seconds, then I can uh, enjoy it in peace. Well, excuse me for doing my job, partner. Sorry to have disturbed you. I don't think anyone in this match has even considered that they might not walk out the winner. I'm sure they have it, Cole. That's the kind of attitude that gets you beat quicker than anything. As soon as you let the slightest doubt into your mind, you can forget about it. And that's something I don't think people realize. The mental conditioning of the WWE superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning. Oh my, the submission hold is locked in. And this ain't easy to get out of either, Cole. It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were gonna wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times... I can't tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, any time before the... And there's the pin! One, two, three. And that's the match! It looks like there just wasn't enough left in the tank to kick out of the pin. That's a tough loss for sure. Here's your but winner. You don't have and what it still, takes. And you the don't have WWE Women's Champion. I don't know if it's a matter of not having what it takes, Taz. Sometimes Stacey it's just not Keebler. your night.